Good morning, South Line East students. Today is May 19th, and I'm Sasha with your news for today. At every lunch period, tickets for the next week's charity events are on sale for $5 each per event. Here's a reminder that the annual East Softball versus East Basketball benefit game is today at 5, and the Kona Ice Truck will be there. In other news, the South Line East tennis team is at regionals. It's springtime, which means girls' tennis is in session. With regionals so close, I talked to some of our varsity tennis players to get an insight into how they're feeling on this year's season. Okay, what do you think about the season so far? So far, our team's been really good. We've been taking dubs left and right. <laughs> I think that we might have a good shot making states this year, and I can see our team improving so much from last year. Yeah. How do you think you've improved as a team? As a team, we've really become closer from last year and we see what works well with each other and overall, we just work together better. As a senior, it's kind of surreal just because this team I've really become close with, especially this year. And I definitely want to hold on to the relationships I've made this year. And I really can't wait to see how this team works in the future. So um, I feel like it's going pretty well. Um, we've gotten a lot of matches in and we've won a lot. I feel like we've gotten a lot better. We've gotten a lot more practice in, especially since it's not a COVID year and it's been a lot, a lot better. Year. <laughs> yes, I will be playing tennis next year um, and I am really excited for next year <laughs> tennis season. How are you feeling about next year's season? What are you hopeful about? Well, we're going to graduate a lot of seniors. Um, what I'm hopeful is that uh, during the off season that folks who are, who are coming back or perhaps incoming freshmen that they work on their tennis games so that when they come to tryouts, they have great forehands and backhands, serves, volleys, and overheads. How do you feel like your team has improved? We've improved a lot uh, all across the board. Working with this team because they're a, a great group to work with. They, they pick up on stuff really fast. They're quick learners. And as a result, um, you know, we, we're just, every, every day we're, we're playing our best tennis. How do you and, feel about the season so far? I think I'm very positive about the season. Uh, we've played a lot of really tough teams. We've had a really tough schedule, but we have done well against key opponents. All right, the key opponents, meaning the teams that we're gonna see in the upcoming regional, which is gonna be a week from Thursday. All right, that is our biggest tournament of the year. That decides who goes to the state tournament. Okay, so we are really, okay, so we are really developing our practices and working on our skills so that we were peaking at that time. Well, by the looks of it, everyone's ready and excited for regionals. Let's switch luck to our girls varsity tennis team Thursday the 19th. And the rest of the sports teams have been doing exponentially well. Here's a look at the video update. The end of the school year is nearing South Line East students. Here's an insight on how the spring sports teams have been doing during their seasons. The South Line East girls soccer team took home a win May 12, beating their cross-time rivals with a score of 5 and up. They are now moving into the LPC championship next week. The boys baseball team played two on May 12. They traveled to face the Pirates of Piggy. In other news, the South Line East softball team swept the day against Milford with the Game 1 resulting in 13-0 and Game 2 resulting in 9-4. The track team athletes are doing exponentially well. Jacob Mack had another PR in the 1100th run, then came back to take down the freshman 3200 record in 1050. Riley Welton wins the one-on-one -on -one dual meet against Lakeland and South Lyon. South Lyon East Boys golf team took home the second place in the tournament, losing by one against Novi at the Orange Theory Fitness Tournament. The team also won against Wild Lakeland Central, shooting a potential new school record of 150 with the final score of 150 and 179. They ranked fourth in state in scoring average and first in D2. That's all the information for today. Have a great day and ready to be easy. The weather for today are partly cloudy conditions all day round with a low of 52 and a high of 77 degrees. That's all for today. Have a great day and remember to be easy.